What's up guys, this is Giovanni White and welcome back to Each Blind on Lights for another angelic tarot reading. So, <clears throat> let's begin, start shuffling and I hope you guys are doing well. A lot of people enjoyed the reading from last night so I really appreciate that. I am very grateful for you guys and uh, thank you for tuning in and please subscribe, like the video and please share it. And um, so yeah, so I want to let you guys know that not only I'm a spiritual consultant and a Reiki master, but I'm also a musician and a model, an entrepreneur, but I'm also a musician and um, I go by Archangel Royal. So you can follow my Spotify, Archangel Royal, you can purchase my music on Apple Music, find me on iHeartRadio and Amazon Music. and. Uh, my uh, new EP is Seven Days Before Dawn. It was released August 26. Please check it out. Please share it. And uh, I appreciate you guys. I appreciate everyone who's showing support as well and sharing my music and adding them to their playlists. I really appreciate that. And um, I appreciate Finland and Germany also for um, streaming my music, not just here in the US. So I really appreciate you guys. Um, so I call my fans the Royal Bloodline. So thank you guys so much. <clears throat> now, so let us begin. And we already got some cards that came out. <laughs> King of Wands, Page of Swords. So, what guidance kind of messages do you have for anyone, guys? Knight of Cups. They're coming out fast. Two of Swords, Page of Pentacles, Six of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, Two of Cups and Reverse. So someone is closing a chapter with someone that they're in a relationship with and they're moving forward and they're trying to, as this person is trying to hold on to them very tight. It's like a door that's closed, but like close on the person and then they're trying to keep it closed and the person as they're trying so hard to pull it open someone also is trying to get back into your life so this person there's so many scenarios that I'm picking up on I was gonna wear eyeliner but I'm not <laughs> it's not often I wear it. this person is worried about their kids because of their connection with this person because uh, their bond with this uh, individual. And so. They have stability, they have financial stability. They have Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, and Archangel Ragu around them, guiding them and protecting them. Definitely in finance because this person wants to create a case where they want to sue them for their money, but they're not going to get it. So that sounds like marriage, so divorce. And like that door represents the divorce. Like this person closed the door. Their intention is to, um, you know, have those papers signed. And this person is like trying not to, like trying to force their way in so they don't want to sign it. As the person wants to move forward. Another scenario is it works out in their favor and they're moving forward. And this other person um, that was divorced uh, feels cold. I'm, I'm seeing like that image of Jack Nicholson and The Shining where he's frozen. This person just feels frozen, he's cold. And they want to try to get back to that person because like cold as in like an empty shell a, a corpse and like that a person who divorced them um 
they just want to be back in their energy and they want to feed on their energy so they can feel alive again sounds like a reptilian <clears throat> and so <sighs> let's see what else uh, military so if someone's a military this person was in the military is that a person so they were cheated on this is a woman who was in the military and their husband was cheating on them the lawyer is invested in this situation Definitely will not fair, and no matter what this other person is trying, the lawyer, because of the lawyer, um, this woman is succeeding no matter what. So the children could still be in this man's life, but the mother definitely is going to get sole custody. Whoever this resonates for, you have sole custody. It's like it's no problem for you to take care of the kids you, you you're able to and you're able to balance everything you got three pentacles you're able to do what's necessary and anything so you know you don't need this person you got the empress you're gonna stand in your power it's like you feel like almost as if like it's a real situation but it's almost as if this was already happened like you were already divorced this person a long time ago like you're handling it so well whoever this resonates for Ace of Pentacles. Yep. So you're handling it so well. You're able to. You have stability regardless. Seven of Cups. This person definitely is going to miss that. In the future, this person definitely going to try to reminisce the past. Try to bring back, you know, their personal stability with you. And, you know, getting your goodness, gracious, get back your energy. So they going to try to work out. And, you know, it's not going to happen. You know, like, you have... Archangel Michael giving you so much strength to stay focused on your your path and your purpose and um, sever the, the the cords all the ties and whatnot. I'm also getting um so this is a, a something else that I'm picking up on uh, children like someone's wondering their kids will be safe. A situation uh, they're moving I'm getting someone who lives in like tornado area like I assume Oklahoma you know tornadoes could appear anywhere like I'm in Massachusetts and we had gotten a tornado like 11 years ago for the first time and um but like I'm getting o Oklahoma because I'm seeing like middle of nowhere and this person is wondering their children be safe so since it's like obviously the end of the year like this has to be like resonating more of like this past spring or summer whenever tornado season come along which you know i'm not from there never been there so i'm not really sure how that works over there but um there's the attentions of moving away and I'm, I'm hearing can i afford it so this person wants to move out of state get away for the safety of the children they don't care that they were born there they don't care the family is there they just care about their children getting away and living in a safer environment I'm getting, getting a loan. Something about talking to a lawyer as well. Just something to, to bring in like that financial stability. Just a way to break through so they this person is able to use the money to invest and work so they can use that money to invest in moving. And it's gonna work out, it's gonna work out in your favor. We go to the bank, wherever you are, you're gonna get that loan. It's gonna work out. And you know, 
you just have to like from there you just have to stay focused on you know and i had to stay focused on getting work um getting a better job for better pay because you know better job for make a faster money and to be able to move a lot sooner this person does have a job but it's not as stable as they wish they already knew it wasn't that stable before they even started working in this this company but um but they'll get something better so then they can like get away have the money to move away a lot sooner Ten of Wands. Oh. Every verse, Ten of Wands in reverse. So the father, he's away for work, he travels, but it's not like. They're not together though, so the mother and father is not together. I'm hearing will I still be in the kid's life? And I'm getting he's gonna move too. Regardless that he and his um gonna show his mother is not together anymore. He'll still be in their life because he's gonna move too. And um So the mother, she doesn't want to bring him into this. She doesn't want to tell him the plans of, you know, just to get the money from him. Cause you know, like they're not together. You know, uh, he's not obligated to, even though like he can let go of his pride and get help out it's just so they could, they could get away. But like, you know, since he has a plan to go to and you know, it's, it's all gonna work out anyway. So they all gonna like move away. I'll Oklahoma to a better place. Um, He's gonna, his job is gonna change. His job gonna change so, you know, he'll be able to have that job that at her state. I'm seeing sea creatures like uh, I'm just seeing the fins where this could be a dolphin or like swordfish but someone likes to fish someone wants to go out there and you know be out in the sea as a form of meditation to get away and you know fish and you know be with their friends I, I see I assume they're friends because like, there's other people on this boat and they're fishing okay so I see so they're catching them with the nets they capture these fish with the nets and uh, it's very uh, meditative for this person. I don't see that it's a job though, it's like a hobby. So someone, some of them like to keep the fish, some of them just do it for the hell of it. Um, that's just one person, but there's this other person who is pretty cruel to these sea creatures. They, uh, This person likes to drink. I see he's abusive. He he has pet dogs and he's abusive towards his dogs. There's a woman who wants to take them away. It's a neighbor. She know what happens with the dogs. I'll get in another scenario. I'm getting in Florida. I, something about the hurricane. Like I know, like that pass. Someone is definitely affected, and I sense that someone up northeast around my area knows someone down there who is struggling. 
and they're worried. So their sisters, okay, so this person's worried about her sister and they're struggling and she doesn't hear from them often. Something about like her husband. She tries to contact her husband, but I'm hearing off signal, so having a hard time down there. But whoever this resonates for, you will hear from them. You hear from them very, very soon. Everything's gonna change. Everything's, things are. Again, things aren't as bad as they have seemed, like on social media and whatnot. But everything's gonna get back to normal, like very fast. Like everything's being taken care of, like rapidly. One of the cards was uh, one of the angels, 72 angels, uh, Kahatel, and I actually sensed him uh, resonate with someone in this reading. Now, Kahatel gets rid of evil ener the evil energies like spirits. There's other purposes he have, but like, if you have like any demonic attachments, you know, you could call upon Kahatel to get rid of them, even get rid of them out of your home. If you have, I sense that there's someone who does have a demonic attachment to them. But you could feel it on your back, like the the right side, like your shoulder blade, and like you could invoke him, which would be even more encapsulating to getting his energy out of your energetic field. And he'll help your energy get into flow. So I got uh, two major arcanas, Wheel of Fortune, and the Moon card. And I got Knight of Pentacles, Knight, Eight of Cups, and um, Knight of Swords, which is a minor arcana. So, but major arcanas are always very significant. Some secrets from the past will come up, and they'll be, for some of you, it'll affect you in a negative way. For others, it'll be very satisfying, something that you need to, to hear from someone. It may not be from that per person specifically. For other people, they're hearing it from someone else, a secret that someone else that they know had help from them. So someone else is gonna come in and tell them things and it's gonna like be like a relief, like, you know, clears a lot of things up that they've been wondering or even if they didn't care anymore, it's still gonna like help get some closure. So you got Ace of Swords, uh, Eight of Swords, you got Ace of Cups, and actually, here and page of wands let me put it in here someone wants to take your will for it someone wants to take i'm sensing a past person they want to take your good fortune that's coming to you they want to be a part of it but they want to take it so they're trying to act like you know they're on your side but they want to take you know, your blessings your success um they're watching to see just like what i was picking up on yesterday they're watching you to see like how far you're getting in life and then when they see even more success they want to come in and they want to be part of that act like they're on your side and they want to take it they want to learn your ways so they can use it against you and throw you off track they want to take your energy they want to become you but they can't there's no way you are divinely protected these people don't understand that the chosen ones are divinely protected they think they could take what's ours but they can't. It's rightfully yours. It's already in your birthright. They might just walk away. You know, they... And um, so on the moon card, it's Archangel Gabriel, and it's right next to the Nine of Pentacles card. You see how, like, Gabriel is reaching for the other angel on Nine of Pentacles. Like, they want to take their Nine of Pentacles their financial stability sweeping on sweeping from beneath them, but it's, they're not gonna succeed at that. So we got five of swords in reverse.
I'm sorry. Thought I said it's right side up. So, a chosen one has been de dealing with bullying, like being gained upon by some people, trying to throw them off track, like throw their energy balance off and um, put them in their headspace. So they won't be present because these people are intimidated by your divine power. You know? You're uh, intimidating who are this resonating for. You're intimidating their demons. They're you're rattling their cage. You know, stay within your light. Um, do what you can to push for and battle them. Call upon Archangel Raghul to help you bring justice, especially Archangel Michael and Archangel Kemayo. And they'll straighten some things out for you. They'll, they'll fight for you. You know, these angels not only can be like holy, they know how to tap into their dark side and be nasty as well. So you call upon them to fight back and drag these people, to drag their asses across the street. <laughs> You know, drag them to their grave. Not kill them, but you know what I mean. You know. Especially Archangel Michael, because he really I'm hearing fuck shit up. And he knows how. He really does. Very powerful energy. They have strong connections to dragons. So to work with angels and dragons is very that's very encapsulating as well. So um it solidifies to like someone's great power working with them too at the same time. And um so Archangel Michael, he could definitely have his dragons like take care of things too. And I'm, I'm hearing like in the darkness, like, and in my mind's eye, I'm also seeing like it's a dark place and there's dragons in the dark and they're attacking. Like, you're, you're not gonna see it coming. It's gonna backfire on these people for doing what they're doing to you. You're fighting back. I'm also getting uh, an ancestors are also with you and pray to them to help you through the situation because these people are cowards. They don't even know why they're attacking you or bullying you or you know targeting you, or gang stalking you and whatnot. And so <clears throat> they're not think they're not gonna last in uh, the hexagon against you. <laughs> You're gonna win that match. Someone's a winner. I see someone I'm playing sports and you know, unexpectedly, I'm seeing football specifically, like, you're unexpectedly the person who actually gets a touchdown. You win for the team, and you're usually, like, that person in the background. Now, you're, like, in a different energy now because of that. So everyone actually sees you. You were, like, that person in the background. Now you got the spotlight. Now people see you, and it's like you're in a parallel world where everything's working out for you now. You know, it's like you stepped into a different realm and now here you are, you are the winner, you are the one who's in the spotlight. And for others, someone is defeating obstacles that was thrown at them in life and you're, you're making it unexpectedly. You didn't see it coming. You were so within your head and the depression that out of nowhere, just boom, like something works out for you, you know, and at times, you know, regardless if you're just someone dealing with depression and you're in your head a lot, you're gonna have moments where you are gonna detach from, you know, you know what you want to happen in your life. You're gonna even detach from the problems that you're just like, okay, whatever, I don't care. And all of a sudden, things start happening for you in your favor because you detach, and it opens so much doors for you when you're detached. You just like whatever. So everything is coming together for you. And you're just like, wow, like, okay, like it really changed your energy quick to very positive. And it just seems so surreal to you and, and, and unreal, like a dream. And then you're accepting it too. And you're like, okay, this is, this is amazing. Like, wow. So congratulations to you on that. And, you know, don't give up. Anyone who's dealing with depression and even may, you know, trigger warning, may even be suicidal. Don't give up because you never know when something positive is going to change like right away and whatever struggles you're dealing with you know, you're gonna get through that just keep faith in your heart and um <clears throat> you know just do your best to detach be present as you can and just have hope somebody's wondering if they still love you i mean if you still love them Four of Swords, Eight of Pentacles, 
seven times. Judgment, but you don't want this person, and you shouldn't be with this person, and you shouldn't bring them back to your life. And some situation will come through when, like, this person is back in your life when that's not your intentions. Don't take them back <clears throat> because with their energy, they're just gonna like get in the way of your uh, progress, and you don't want that. So just don't even bother with this person. You know. I also pick up on you're someone who feels different from the world. You're very gifted. And you're becoming more and more conscious of your gifts. It's like new things are unlocking. Your DNA is unlocking more like 12 strings and you're tuning in more. You're listening to more binaural beats, more uh, 432 hertz and you know, more relaxing meditative music and it's helping you grow so much into your uh, higher self and it's it's amazing it's wonderful so congratulations on that and um if you're understanding you know your purpose more you're practicing your abilities more and more your breathing techniques and you know just bracing that side of you and understanding how limitless you are i just feel that like you are someone who is so deep into the 3d and, you know, there's superficial people that you're around who are more into materialism and go clubbing and drink and all this stuff, just that party life and just these superficial things that's just not evolving. And now here you are and you are ascending and you're tapping to your gifts and your higher self and you're, you're someone who can see into different realms and the higher realms and that's really good. Like, it's amazing. And you're doing a wonderful job with that. You know, you're also learning how to close portals that shouldn't be opened. And even helping other people understand who are seeking the truth and who want to be enlightened as well and learn about themselves. So that's really good. So this is uh, what I was picking up on you guys for the collective. I uh, thank God for allowing me to connect and do these readings for you. And, um, so I really appreciate you guys tuning in. So please like the video, please subscribe, and please share it. Thank you so much. And check out my music, Archangel Royal. I appreciate you guys.